Oh, I hope there won't be more guests tonight. Yeah, I hope so. Brother, can you stop cleaning for a minute and come over? I have a surprise for you. Happy birthday, Ulf. Wow, so peculiar. Thanks, Lucia. You know, I always tried to protect you, but I'm afraid. <gasps> Hide, quickly. Don't forget the rope. Don't tie up the rope too hard. We'll finish quickly. Don't forget that you need him alive. It is essential. Get him. Take him to the wagon and lock him in a cage. for the horse should be in the basement. I need to take a ladder in the barn to go down there.
This is my brother's chest. There should be a saddle in it. I need to figure out how to open it. Why didn't Ulf tell me about the... afraid. I'm not gonna hurt you. I just wanted to make sure that you were okay. You don't often see people around here. Thank you. It could have been better, but at least I didn't break my neck. What is wrong with this forest? Why did my horse get scared of it? This place is the witch forest. Local folks are terrified of it for good reason. There's just something about it. It has an air of death. Did a wagon pass here? Did you see which way it went? That way. You better not go there. Judging from my observations, the further you stay from the witches, the better off you'll be. They took my brother! I have to help him. Brother? Is your brother a werewolf in a cage? The wagon brought him into the forest, but it left without him. I suppose he is still there. I'll be careful. I must find my brother. Thank you. You helped me a lot. Is it Ulf? So he is in this forest, and he's still alive! I must find him quickly.
What are those creepers? They pounced on me when I got too close. I better stay away from them. Are you okay? How long have you been there? Who are you? You saved me! I think I'm okay. I'm Herbie, and I'm a Redictus. Have you seen a wagon around here? I saw it. It was carrying a witch. I fell into the pit because of her. The witch went to the clearing with the werewolf, but returned with the fruit. I decided to run away from her, but I stumbled on a root and fell in the hole. With the fruit? What kind of fruit? And what about the werewolf? Where is he now? So you don't know anything about the witch forest, do you? Witches often come to this glade. Terrible creepers grow there. They suck up all your life, all your energy, and turn it all into a fruit. And then the witches take them. I don't know what they are doing with those fruits, but somehow they prolong their life by using them. Probably because of that, they rule for so long, and no one can stop them. You mean my brother is still on that clearing, among the creepers? Yes, but most likely he can no longer be saved. I'm sorry. Why do you think so? How do you know all this? The druid who sheltered me told me. He knows everything about the forest and magical creatures. Let's go pay him a visit. We will go through the caves. Here, take this. It will help open the way to the druid's house.
fragile. The tree near the ruins can no longer be saved. Today, the witch passed there again. I got scared and fell into the hole. I thought that I was done for, that I would no longer be of help to you. Hmm. And who is this? This girl saved me. Oh, I didn't even ask your name. Hello, I'm Lucia. I need help. That witch brought my brother to the forest, but she was all alone when she left. Herbie said he was left on the clearing with the creepers. I need to save him. Lucia, I'm Edgil. You will not be able to get to your brother alone. The creepers you saw in the field are eager to suck out life from anyone who gets in their way. And the werewolves are the most valuable prey for them. But I can help you. What do I have to do? Wait, how do you know my brother is a werewolf? I myself did not know it until yesterday. I... I knew your parents. But there is no time for this. Let's make a torch that will scare away the creepers. I have an old one in the attic. You will need to prepare it in a certain way. I will give you a list of actions. Let me help you. You'd better take a rest. You went through a lot today. Okay. I hope it will work out all right. Lucia, come back to me when it's done. I will enchant the torch so it will scare the creepers off. This is how we'll get to your brother. Did you understand everything? Yes, thank you for your help. I am on my way. Edgel said he had an old torch in the attic. I should look around and find something to get there.
The torch probably is in this chest with three locks. How does it open? What is this letter? Oh, it has my name.
Thank you.
पास पर आ जा This amulet, I've never seen anything like it before. It is a unique fusion of technology of the ancients and magic. It seems that it saved Ulf's life. Furthermore, now it prevents him from dying. So there's hope. Can we still save him? I know one potion that can help, but it was made for people. And your brother is, well, not exactly a human being now, so it may not work. But this is the best chance that we've got. We should try. Uh, how can I help? Find the recipe in the book in the closet. Then collect the necessary ingredients and brew a potion. I will stay with your brother and try to keep him alive if the amulet stops working. Thank you. 
I wish I could get that spyglass. I could use it to search for the Black Lily from the lighthouse.
did everything right. Don't blame yourself. Unfortunately, no one knows how to transform a werewolf into a human being again. So what now? What's next? Should I just stand here and watch him die? I told you that this is our best chance, but it's not the only one. Those witches took your brother's energy for some kind of ritual. I don't know their customs, but I'm sure we can stop them. You need to get into the city. What can I do? I'm alone. I don't know these places, and I don't know much about witches. My friend will help you. She knows everything about witches. When you reach the city, light a signal fire in the watchtower. She will see the signal and come to you. I'm sure you'll come up with something together. Well, okay. It's just, in the past, Ulf always took care of me, and now everything changed. But I'll do what I can. Now go. Our time is running out. Here, take these runes. I use them to seal the entrance to the city. Water. Bring water, please.
Thank <laughs> Thank you.
Thanks. I've been hanging here for ages without food or water. What's happened to you? What have you done to be punished so severely? I was punished for, uh, stealing. We're orphans, so we live as we can. I tried to steal food for myself and, uh, my brother. Oh, brother! I hope he's all right. I need to get to the city somehow. When will the gates open? Make yourself comfortable. They won't open until morning. This is the Town Hall of Witches. They protect it like the apple of their eye. Is there any other way? I have a brother, too. And he's in big trouble right now. I simply can't wait until morning. I will help you, if you will help me. Let me out, and I'll show you the secret entrance to the city. I promise. I can't break a lock like that. And the cage is too strong. I'll do it myself. Just find my lockpicks. I left them at the groom. Sometimes he allows me to spend the night in his place. The lockpick I need right now is one of a kind. Here's something for you. It will help you get into the house. You're good. Thank you for helping me. By the way, I'm Elliot. And you? I'm Lucia. Now, show me the entrance to the city and go to your brother. He's probably worried. My brother? Ah! Oh, to my brother! Can you see that shack over there? There's a secret passageway. It passes under the castle wall. You will enter the city in one of the lanes, so no one will notice. I have to go now. Good luck to you and your brother. Thanks. Is the passage. Maybe I need to open it somehow? I need to look around here.
Great, there's no one here. Now I need to get out as carefully as possible and find the watchtower.
This is the signal oven I have to ignite. I need to find something to light it. I won't hurt you. You would already be dead if I wanted that. Who told you how to find me? Edgel, the druid from the witch forest. I'm sorry if I scared you. I guess that Edgel didn't warn you that I'm a witch. My name is Scarlet. Why were you looking for me? My brother is dying. Edgel told me that witches are going to use his energy for some kind of ritual. He also told me that you can figure out how to help him. It's a resurrection ritual, and I've heard of it. By using the energy of magical creatures, magic, and the technology of the ancients, life from the fruit passes into the body. They use this ritual to resurrect our twitches. Is there anything else we can do to help Ulf? He's with Edgel now. Even though he's still alive now, I can't be sure how long it will last. Hmm. The only way that comes to mind is to perform the ritual with your brother instead of the archwitch. Return his energy into his own body. I don't understand. How? Is this even possible? Why not? Witches are not gods. They are just human beings. And they are mortals. It's time to remind them of this. But how can we do it? Do not be afraid. I will help you. But I don't know much about the ritual. There should be a book of the ancients about the ritual in the library. We need to study it. Here, take the key. Let's go quickly. There, at the end of the hall, the book is protected by the energy field of the ancients. There must be a way to disable it.
That's what I thought. The ancients were so wise, so much smarter than us. And the witches destroyed the entire race. Now we will never know all their secrets. Did you find the information we need? Yes. I can see all the information about the ritual that was twisted to match the witch's cruelty. It's performed using a special sarcophagus. I know where we can find it. I hope we can make it. Make it? Until what? The ritual should be performed at dawn. I think it will happen today. We can go to the temple first, open the sarcophagus, and put your brother's body inside instead of the body of the Arch Witch. Then we need to take Ulf there as soon as possible. It's not that simple. The sarcophagus opens with a special key. Draw this sketch. First of all, we need to make the same.
This key must be activated on the altar of the ancients, otherwise it won't work. I'd like to go back to Ulf and make sure that he's... Exactly. I know of such an altar not far from Edgel's place. We'll activate the key and then go after your brother. Excellent. Now the key should work. Let's go to Edgel. Scarlet, I wish I could meet you one day without a tragic occasion. Did you come up with something? Yes, there is a chance to save the boy. We will try to perform the resurrection ritual with my brother. We just need to get to the temple. That's right. And we need to do it before dawn. <laughs> it's a risky plan, but it suits you well. I'll help you to cross the river quickly. Unfortunately, I can't go with you. Why? I am the keeper of this forest. This position gives me special powers, but also binds me. I can't leave the forest. Everything will be all right. We can handle it together. Just help us get to the temple. My friend will help you cross the river. Is this your friend? Yes! Hop on his back! I'm afraid there's nothing else I can do. Great. We're almost there. The temple is on top of the waterfall. The elevator is broken. We won't be able to bring Ulf up, even if we work together. Then I'll go up alone, and find a way to fix the elevator.
know what happened to the elevator down there. Do I know? Oh, yes, I broke it. <laughs> Who are you? Why did you come here? We don't want to see anyone here. I... Uh, I'm Lucia. I need to get to the temple up there. Uh-oh. She needs to go to the temple. Ask your witchy witch gal pals to use their magical magic to launch the elevator. Ah! N no You've got it all wrong. They aren't my friends. On the contrary, we are against them. The world has gone mad. All this magic, witchcraft, and the resistance. It's impossible to tell friends from foes now. You never know who to trust. Uh, what? And my birdie, my poor baby bird, bitten, poisoned. Uh, can I help you somehow? And will you fix the elevator? Of course, quid pro quo, tit for tat. There's no other option these days. My bag, my bag is missing, stolen. Find it. I will think. I've thought. Yes, I'll help. Help the baby bird, and I'll help you. This is fair. Bring the bag. Here's the key. There's a recipe of ointment for the birdie in the bag. Make an ointment. Cure the baby bird. You scratch my back, and I'll scratch yours. My baby must survive. Miller is clearly out of his mind. Maybe he just dropped the bag or hid it nearby and forgot. I need to look around. Here are the berries I need. It looks like there's more inside the box, but how do I open it?
Cuddles, you're alive. You'll be fine. Here's the key to the mill. You'll find your stuff there. Should I just go there and what? Turn the place upside down? Won't you help me? Cuddles, I'm so happy. We're going to eat and then we're going to sleep and I'll never let you fly this far again. Ugh. It's great that you worked it out. Ulf is too heavy. 
Let's go to the temple, quickly. Soon dawn will start. Witches will be gathering here soon. We need to find you a hooded cloak so you won't attract unwanted attention. This ore attracts metal. The ancients used it often, and the witches imitate them without having any idea of its real purpose.
How can we pass this guard? Is there any other entrance? No. Let's try to get through. Only archwitches are allowed to enter the sarcophagus. We have an official assignment from them. We must get into the sarcophagus to complete it. Get out of the way, if you don't want to make anyone angry. What kind of assignment? I should have definitely been told. Are you okay? Yeah, just give me a few minutes. <laughs> be careful, it's a poisonous mold that can be killed by alcohol. now.
We have everything we need to open the sarcophagus. Do it, and I will go get your brother. Let me get her out. Now let's put Ulf in here. Faster. <sighs> Sisters, the sun is already rising. Let's raise the sarcophagus. will begin. Rise up, sister. One day, we can figure out how to make my brother return to his human form. Well, good luck to you. I hope our paths will cross again one day. <laughs> 